as humans, are we truly capable of executing the God kind of unconditional love? <laughs> For example, living in the 99 to find the one which defies our human wisdom and logic. How far can we go to not be reckless or abandon our duty to protect ourselves and our own? The Bible teaches us what we can do, not what we can't. And you as a Christian, your faith must always be what the Bible says you can do and not what you can't. In Matthew chapter 18, verse 21, Peter said, Lord, how often should my brother sin against me? And I forgive him because after seven times, I can't do it again. Then Jesus answered in the next verse, I do not say to you up to seven times. I say 70 times, seven times. That's in one day. You see, that figure is not a figure. It's an idiomatic expression. It's a metaphor in Jewish language. Seven is the number of complete. So he's saying, as often as, as they do, you forgive them. That's one. You are capable of unconditional love. You are a child of God. You have the nature of God in you. Then how do you protect yourself? Because the person is concerned also about Okay, without me being a victim, people now take advantage of, which is true. Philippians and chapter 1. So let's read from verse 9 to 13. I pray that your love may abound still more and more in knowledge. So you grow in knowledge and all discernment. Discernment is actually an appendage of wisdom and understanding, which helps you to know how to act appropriately per time. Verse 10. That you may approve the things that are excellent. That you may be sincere. You, are, you, you have to be sincere. Not that you are planning to show somebody pepper. You, and without offense. Once you step into offense, you have stepped out of love. Lot and Abraham parted way. But Abraham was not in offense. How do we know? The day Lot was in problem. But he fought to save the life of Lot. Supposing they kill Abraham in that war. What do you think? Being filled with the fruit of righteousness. Which, by, which are by Christ to the glory of God and to his praise. So, fruit of righteousness. So, even when you are trying to design and you are trying to walk circumspectly and you don't want to ask yourself, is this, are this fruit of righteousness? 